It's time for sports, everybody. We're kind of like one. This one that I am giving to Daphne Saunders Neely. Yes, she's a year old and she's a year worse. She's still miserable. My goodness, Daphne, when will you change? The Grandmama Basketball Association Christmas Shakedown Basketball Jam played in the weekend St. George's Gym in honor of the Sports Insider. Let's go. Basketball fans had good reason to celebrate his love for the game. Orrin McPhee giving remarks and accolades to a young man committed to young people and sports. That's Ozzy the Insider Simmons, who has a great love for basketball. The executives of the GBAVA decided to honor Ozzy, and it was really his hard work. Past and present players on to say thank you to Ozzy. Norris Bain said it best. Ozzy will go above and beyond the call of duty for young people and sports. Ozzy, you have always been an individual who give your time to sports, and thank you, bro. A special moment for the sports insider, and he was touched. Front end keep calling me and say send it. Um, that he was going to honor me. I, you know, I don't like to be on it, but I usually honor a lot of people in the community. So I was uh, when I came here and saw all this going on, I was very surprised, and I want to say um, I'm truly thankful for what you have done, and and you know, because I made you know made a contribution to help in basketball because basketball helped me throughout um, 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 the island and traveling and knowing pe and people. But that's why I give so much back to basketball. The basketball community is saying a special thank you to Ozzy for his hard work. Three Young said it was a no-brainer. Not only myself, but a couple of good friends and remember Ozzy and give him a token of our appreciation over the years. It's been a long time because I was a player. I remember getting kicked out of the gym and he was the one coming to save me. <laughs> so, hey, like I say, uh, life is a cycle. Basketball builds relationships forever through friendships, and that's what it's all about. The Christmas Shakedown Basketball Jam featured eight teams, Abaco and Pelican Bay on court, and this one was fireworks from the start. Abaco game plan was to take it right to Pelican Bay. Pelican Bay needed some answers for that Abaco attack. Abaco with the good hands and defeated Pelican Bay 42-38. Abaco got to the championship round, defeating the Gym Rats 39-35 in the semis. Lorenzo Davis with 21 in that one. But in the finals, Abaco lost to the GB Shipyard Cruises 75-55. Abaco got 19 from Paquito Bastiat, Emily Penn, and Jabbar Light won. He was named the MVP. My basketball, uh, Shavano Buddy Hill, the New Orleans Pelicans, losing to the San Antonio Spurs, 113-100 NBA play. Buddy in the starting rotation again, 14 points, 3 rebounds, 2 assists, 25 minutes of play. Buddy was 2 for 3 from the arc and 6 of 11 from the floor. And overseas, uh, Grandma was John Quote J.J. Jones playing in the Warrior Bank League over there. As far as Green Women's Basketball League, they defeated KB Stars, 59-41. J.J., 25 points, 14 boards, 3 block shots, 29 minutes of play. Not bad. And from softball, Churchill North. Max Speeding on Friday, St. George's uh, Jaguars winning the senior boys uh, title. They held off the Tabernacle Falcons 8 7. The Jaguars, Trevon McKinney, and the MVP. The Falcons, the Tabernacles of the senior girls' champs, Bishop McDonald and junior boys, and the Panthers of Sister Mary Patricia Russell. They are the junior girls' champions. And uh, our director, Kirk Cooper, says that's it. He got to go home to speak with Tunia. So let's go to the break.